And on top of dealing with the storm, 10 people who lived in a Norwich apartment building forced out of their homes tonight. That's because the roof collapsed just before 11 o'clock this morning at the building on Washington Street. News 8's Tina Detell on the scene there in southeastern Connecticut. Folks who live in this building tell me the roof wasn't in the greatest shape anyway, but now it's downright dangerous. The woman living in this corner apartment reportedly described the collapse as sounding like thunder, and then she saw insulation fall past her window. Ten people forced out of their Washington Street apartment building in Norwich because of heavy snow. The whole face of it, the bricks are coming off, the whole top of uh, the overhang of the roof's all falling apart. In New London, these guys had their own problems. He has to go to work, so we're just trying to pull out the car. We got stuck, so then we pulled out the truck so we can tow the car. Then the truck got stuck. It's hard work trying to get to work. Domino's is delivering, right? Well, the power's out right now, but I got to get there. As soon as it comes back on, we're going to start delivering, so it's going to be a fun day. Challenges all over the city. No, I'm stuck with the plow. I had to be dug out a few times. It's a part of the job to, to clean up the sidewalks, open up the curbsides for wheelchair accessibility deliveries. A little out of breath here. Uh, but I recommend you eat a good breakfast before you come out and do this. Shoveling could have been more dangerous for April Vitone. A close call with a collapsed branch. We were shoveling and there was just a small branch. This has never happened before in all the storms that we've had. And then uh, went inside and we heard loud crackling. Kind of sounded like gunshots came out and just branches all over the place. The danger here continues. A couple of the branches which have broken off are actually resting on power lines. On the scene in New London, Tina Detell, News 8.